When Katniss and Peeta were on the train to the capital, they ate the most amazing meal of their lives. Lamb chops were the main dish, so today we're showing you how to make them tender and juicy. Don't forget to serve it with our garlic mashed potatoes. A combination fit for the capital's finest meal. For our main course tonight, we are serving the capital's finest lamb chops. You want to know the secret ingredient to this dish? Well, Oh, a plastic bag? Ziploc bag. <laughs> Our best friend for marinating. We are doing just two, because we want to serve them fresh to our guests, so we're going to marinate a little baggie. Now, the whole recipe calls for a lot of garlic and rosemary, but we're just going to add a little bit. So if you follow the whole recipe, you're going to use about 12 cloves of garlic and about four sprigs of rosemary. We're just going to do a little eyeball in here. I'm going to toss in some garlic, some rosemary. You want to do some salt and pepper? How much? Just uh, like this Another much? pinch. Another pinch. Yeah. And a nice amount of olive oil. And then we're gonna shake it up. Ooh! I know you like to do that. I so do like to do that. Give you the honors. So the lamb chop is the rib meat of yeah, the what lamb. Yeah, what is it? Oh, oh the rib I never meat. knew that. You can buy it either in the rack. There's eight ribs on a rack, and they uh -huh. say that serves about three people. Okay. So depending on how many guests you have, that's how you can decide how many racks of lamb you wanna buy. They usually come either two two together or the whole rack, but I had our butcher even um, separate them more just so they take less time to cook. And <laughs> Am I smashing you're too much? You're smashing them. <laughs> this isn't the smashed potatoes. <laughs> I was just trying to tenderize That's it. That's really funny. Ideally, you want to let it sit out for about half an hour in the juices just okay. to let them really marinate. But ours were already at room temperature, so we're going to go ahead and just stick them on. Nice. So I have a screaming hot pan Ooh. ready for action. Ah! And depending on how well done you like them, we like them a little bit more well done. Yeah, we do. It's not really the proper way, but we're gonna cook them about three minutes on each side. Sizzle! So our lamb is cooked, and now we get to do the best thing. The tasting. The tasting. Chink. Yum. Did you know that lamb is surprisingly high in omega-3s? Oh my God. It tastes better than a fish oil pill. <laughs> it's so good. They're delicious. Wow. Super moist, really easy. The garlic no and the rosemary are incredible. Let it sit out and marinate for a while. The longer uh. it marinates, the more delicious they become. Go home, make these. Send us a picture of your finished product. And if we like your picture, if we think it's like the best picture anyone sent us, we'll send you one of these Hunger Games pins. To find out more, click here. Come on, we know you want to. Click something else.